Hi everyone, this is the UR202 homage project that was started roughly two years ago just to honor and learn from the watchmakers over at Urwerk. Uh, the project originally started with just a fascination for their timepieces and also just as a challenge to see if recreating a watch of this complexity could be done. Uh, over the course of the two years I spent roughly 1200 hours and $2200 worth of prototyping and manufacturing all the components. Uh, that being said, though, I don't think it should diminish the value of these timepieces in any way. I think, if anything, it's only increased my appreciation for their work. Uh, you have smaller features such as the telescopic minute hands and the rear winding turbines that really require a vast amount of research and development to get done properly. Uh, I was able to execute these components on the CAD assemblies of SOLIDWORKS, but really making them come to life is another challenge entirely. Uh, I'll run through the movement just so you guys can see what's going on. Uh, it works just like the UR202, so right now we're looking at 910 over here. And see the barrel in the back is getting set up for the next position. So right now it's setting for 10 o'clock. So there's 10 o'clock. Uh, it runs forward or backwards just as easily. It's not gonna damage the movement or anything. That makes setting the time pretty straightforward. Another thing that was pretty nice was the lugs are actually pretty wide on this watch, but you'll see even with the tiny wrist like mine, it still sits pretty nicely, and overall it looks good even on a smaller wrist like mine. Uh, overall, it's been an amazing project to work on, and it's been a big eye-opener to the world of watchmaking.